Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we will discuss Janic Balance Theory or Sex Determination in Drosophila. In Drosophila, there are two sex chromosomes that is XX and XY. In case of female, there are two X chromosomes. So when two X chromosomes are present in that fruit fly, that is female. And male have X and Y. So here, male is heterogametic and female is homogametic. But the interesting thing is, this Y chromosome does not determine the sex of Drosophila. Means this Y chromosome does not play any role in sex determination in case of Drosophila. But sex is, sex of Drosophila is determined by ratio of autosomes to sex chromosomes. So here sex is determined by ratio of autosomes to sex chromosome. Drosophila is diploid organism. So if it is diploid, then it have two set of chromosomes. So in case of autosomes, it have two sets. That is, we can write it like A and A. So it have two homologous chromosomes. So it have two pair of autosomes. If it is haploid, then it have one pair. So it, if it is diploid, then it have two pair of autosomes. So when I can write it, two autosomes, when the ratio of an autosome to the X, if there are two X chromosomes, X and X, then what is ratio? Its ratio is one. Then this fruit fly will develop into female. But when the ratio of autosome to the sex chromosome, or that is X, if it is X and Y, then there is ratio of X to these autosome is 0.5 then it will develop into female and if ratio is between 0.5 to 1 then fruit fly will be intersex it will be between male and female it may have both characters some characters of male and some have of female <laughs> so here sex is determined by ratio of autosomes to sex chromosome. In case of Drosophila, Y chromosome does not play any role in sex determination. This phenomenon first discovered by Brises in 1921 and he put forward the theory of genic balance. So this was discovered by Briz and then he gave on this finding, he gave theory of genic balance. Mm. So here, ratio of autosome to the sex chromosome decides the sex of fruit fly. If it comes 1, then it is female. If it comes 0.5, then it is male. And if it is between 0.5 and 1, then it may have character of both male and female. So here, why is not important for sex determination? So this is genic balance theory. 